Hello folks, my name is The Brady and this is The Bird Mom and we are back with another snack crate video. We haven't done one of these in a little while. We have three snack crates sitting in our room ready to be open for a video but we just hadn't gotten around to it. So welcome back to the channel Bird Mom. It's Hello. good to have you here. And uh, do you have the, uh, the opening utensil? Thank you. I need to I'm, sharpen I'm, I'm this. scared. You, you, there we go. Okay. <laughs> uh, right. So the little message here is once again salam. So we talked about that in the uh, Morocco crate, uh, which kind of leans us towards possibly North Africa, mi Middle Eastern region, like that general place in the world so we'll see where this is i'm i'm assuming middle east because we already got in africa so i'm bad at geometry <laughs> that, that's fair uh at least you're honest about it Ooh. Ooh. It, it's always ooh. we're so easy it's uh it's pakistan okay so do you want to pick our first item no of course we Okay, then I, I guess we'll do... We see a lot of potatoes. Yeah, we, we got a lot of three potato. bags of chips, like, right at the top, which is kind of normal. Uh, so this one looks fun. It's Curly's Potato Crinkle Chips. French cheese. French cheese? I thought this was Pakistan. What are we doing here? Um... I actually don't know too much if there is any sort of relationship with Pakistan and France. If there is something there and I'm overlooking something big, then well, let me know. Because I'm sure we would like to know. Because I don't know too much about Pakistan. I know nothing. But it's crinkle chips. That's an interesting word. What, what do we call these? The the ones with the little, the little bumpies. Depends on... The brand. Uh, I, I forgot what these are. There, there's there's a word for like this shape of a chip that has like the little the little bumpy parts. Do you know it? Are you holding holding? Uh, I don't know. No, I just know that I don't mm. particularly like this cut of chip. That is that is a weird. You know, it has been sitting for a while. No, that doesn't. I don't know. The texture does feel like it might have been because it's been sitting for a little while. Maybe. It might be still. <laughs> oh, no. So it might be a bit of a, an unfair judgment. I, I don't mind. They don't taste great. I don't mind slightly stale chips. I say as I have another. I'm trying to get the flavor. Either the ketchup or French cheese variety. We got oh, the French cheese variety. I we got the ketchup. That would have been our second example of ketchup flavored chips, right? Did we get that in the Canadian box? Yeah. I know it's what we um, thought we were going to get. No, maybe. <laughs> it's been so long. I'm getting cat hair in my mouth. But yeah, flavor-wise, they're not very strong. No. So, they're... Eh. We'll, we'll still eat them, I'm sure. Oh, at least we got the soda. <gasps> ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm very excited about some stuff that I'm seeing. <laughs> well, I get it. I'll have to start getting the uh, the sodas in the future. So, Kokomo. Kokomo. You want to open uh, this while I take a look at our thing like right here? It looks like the little Hello Panda thing. Yeah, I have seen those. I have had those pretty this. recently, actually. A crisp and buttery biscuit filled with sweet chocolate cream. Featuring fun graphics printed on the outside that yeah, look good enough guys. to eat, literally. I don't, I don't think I want to eat... The children on the package. Oh, that is really cute. Want to show them the one you got? Got a little, little fishy. Got a little fishy. He looks stoned. <laughs> I gotta... <laughs> Sorry. He does. He does. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, okay let's give it a shot. I wasn't sure if I should just go right for it or if I should let it sit for I a little. I to see the cross section. <laughs> It's kind of like a melt-in-your-mouth sort of biscuit, which mm -hmm. you either like or you don't. I love that kind of biscuit. Uh, the chocolate's whatever, but I think overall, 
coming together. That, that's a decent snack right there. Um, Pretty good. Hmm. I'd give that one a thumbs up. All right. Uh, I want to kind of get through some of these chips. Do you mind if we no. pick another one? Mm -hmm. you have a preference? No. Okay. No potatoes. Okay. Um, <laughs> Can't this, read that one. This one looks like it says shall, S-H-A-H-L, or maybe that's an I. Uh, I'll give you a look here. It probably says, uh, oh, Shahi is what it says, like, what it looks like it says phonetically on the little paper here, but... I don't know exactly how it should be pronounced, but chili chips. Uh, so Why would you choose the chili flavored something? Mm -hmm. Why would you pick spicy I, I after just pick, all this torture you I, put yourself I, through? I don't mind spicy. Yeah. There's like a reasonable <laughs> level of spice that I can tolerate. Okay, looking for your next adventure in Flavortown? I didn't, I didn't know uh, Flavortown uh, operated in Pakistan. Uh, packaged with only the finest Pakistani spices, these hot little potato sticks are seasoned just right. That doesn't really tell us a whole lot. They smell like potato. It, it looks like a potato stick. We, ha we have some of these. I, mm -hmm. I, I don't have them much anymore. I used to have them a lot as a kid. Like, not this specific kind. They're, they're very plain. These are... Oh. What is that? Yeah. <laughs> Gotta go back for one more. I don't think the sample size was good enough. Mm. 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 That's kind of good. Uh, I, I do like the spices. It's not actually all that hot at all. The spice is just... Oh. Just back. Hold still. Mm. You got a little thing in... There you go. Yeah, you had a little piece of potato in Ew. your uh, in your hair. <laughs> I'm still trying to taste. I don't, I don't know if that was from now or before. There's all the all the chips you eat. They're not actually spicy, but tickle my throat. <laughs> they're they're. I enjoy the seasoning. I would say this is a. Yeah. I prefer this to the other chip. I, I it would be apples and oranges to compare it to the. Uh, to the other thing, I guess it depends on the mood. I guess I like the uh, the little biscuit cookie things more right now, <laughs> but I could probably see myself liking that more depending on the mood I'm in. I, I want like sweets right now. Um, all right, your turn. You, you, you're going the hard way. <laughs> oh, this looks like a good time. Okay, do we have this on here? Yes, we do. It's uh, it says biscani chocolate chip. Oh, they actually are just cookies. Mm -hmm. I thought I thought they were chalk like cookie flavored things. Uh, it looks it looks French. There there's That's definitely French. a French presence here that I don't know much about. I walking into this didn't know much about Pakistan. I mean, if you read the stuff on there, it might tell you something. Hold on, hold on. I I gotta read the thing about the snack though. Whether you need a sweet treat to snack on, or you're looking for something to enjoy with your coffee, these yummy chocolate chip cookies are for you. How do they feel? Hard. Chips so, Ahoy. So, yeah, Chips Ahoy. It feels like a Chips Ahoy. Yeah, I, I like my cookies soft, but it doesn't mean it's not going to be good, just because it's not my idea. You don't cookie. drink coffee either. I do not. This would go well with coffee. Is it dark chocolate? Is it? No, it's milk, milk chocolate. chocolate. Okay. Oh, does it say? You just assume it's milk chocolate? No, it's just, I, I know everything. <laughs> Definitely not dark chocolate. It's fine. It's a cookie. It is, uh, is a nice little snack cookie. I, I love how much we describe things as exactly what they are. Is what it is. Because it, it's just, like, the pinnacle of meeting my expectations. <laughs> uh, which is fine. Um, because my expectations for a cookie are generally pretty good. 
It looks like we got a lot of different options in here. Like, do you see all, all these things? We got, like... Mm -hmm. Oh, we got, like, two separate things for these. So that's fun. So we can have one for now and one for later. Go for it. I'll okay. put that one over here. These are Jiggles Watermelon Jelly. Uh, so they're, they're little gummies. Just, just gummies, it seems. Oh, uh, so looks like there were other options. Packing a punch of tartness that you're sure to love. These crunchy, chewy red and black berries are blasting with fruity flavor. Oh, no. hey, that's the different flavor. No, yeah. the watermelons are on the back. Uh, but essentially the same thing, but with watermelon, I would imagine. Uh, so we might have some blackberry ones in there if we're lucky. They gave we us also have Jiggles Crunch. They gave us two of the packages, but they gave us two of the two packages of the same flavor. I think you and I both prefer watermelon. Hmm. Did your tooth just hurt too? Mm -mm. Okay, my, my tooth just hurt. <laughs> no, my jaw. <laughs> They're not like super hard or anything to chew. So it's not, that's not the reason I felt toothache. I just think I need to floss better. Uh, but yeah, this is kind of, as far as, as far as I'm concerned, like the genre of candy I enjoy the most, like gummy things with little sour crystals on it but it doesn't really taste like much it doesn't have a ton of taste uh the texture is a little bit hard i mean it, it's better the more you chew into it but like it's like i'd say a sour patch kid is the peak of like the texture for a gummy candy for me mm -hmm. and i'd hate to judge something for what it's not but every time i look at a sour gummy candy i'm just wishing it's a sour patch kid so, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Do you want to, like, it's power right. rank what we have so far? Sorry, I'm, like, really awkward today. It, it, it's been a while since we've been on camera. I'm sorry I haven't asked you your opinion more often. Uh, but we'll do that now. Let's, uh, let's see what we got. Do you have... Is there a clear winner so far? <laughs> Not really. Are they, do you, do you have like a top two? Yeah. The, a 1A um, and 1B? The Kokomo and the, and the chili chips. Yeah, I, you know, I, I'd say I, I'm feeling about the same. Like, though I typically prefer the little gummy guys, th those just aren't top notch for me. They're, there's always the caveat that maybe they were just sitting too long. Like, they may have been better if they weren't months old. Mm. We we have to give. They're in bags. We we have to give Pakistan the benefit of the doubt, J just in case maybe other people's experience is different from ours. Let's say that maybe, but we can only judge it by what we have right now. It's also opinion. My yeah. opinion and your opinion can be different. Yours is wrong, but <laughs> I'll fight you. Go. Okay. What do you want to do next? What is, in your opinion would be the best thing to do? that is <laughs> oh there's a couple of them. oh this looks like it might be a pain chocolate paste chocolate oh, paste no. oh do we do you want to start with this let's do this later i don't know it says now on it it says now okay it says now right on it <laughs> let's oh uh, let's do it should we okay, open both one. no we just do okay one. We'll, we'll share let's see what, what kind it? of like... texture it is Oh, oh, that might be pretty good. I'm just gonna take that. Oh, I kind of, I, I kind of like it. Oh, did we show you the thing? I did because it, it says now. Yeah, it says now, and this is what the chocolate looks like. It looks it's like chocolate. Poop. It's <laughs> pooping. Well, chocolate <laughs> typically looks like puke. Oh, well, let's find it on here, right? Uh, wake up your morning with some added decadence. This sweet chocolate paste has a delicate taste, perfect for topping things like pancakes and waffles. I was confused as to why it said morning. So we'll have to get some pancakes or waffles. It's, it's chocolate, mm. but like really fake tasting chocolate. <laughs> yeah. That's not necessarily bad. 
There's a lot of really artificial <laughs> There's like tasting things. The tiniest bit of cocoa powder in this. <laughs> That's wonderful. And it says there's hazelnut flavor. I'm so getting that. Nutella kind of thing. I am absolutely getting that. <laughs> You're gonna have more. No, you can't. <laughs> I just wanted to. And I guess it. I'm having more. <laughs> it's a fun one. It doesn't taste great. I have no problem with that. I think that's perfectly fine. I would love to have it on my pancakes. I pancakes are yucky. Alright, I'll fight you. <laughs> <laughs> again. You're fired again. Alright. We haven't done a chip in a couple. <laughs> Do you want to wrap, wrap up the chip selection? Sure. Yeah. Chills. Potato chips. But they're not chilled. They're lemon and chili. Therefore, it implies that... They, they might not be as chill. They might have a little bit of a zingy zing to them. Both things that I could describe as zing. Lemons have a zing. Chili has a, a zing. It would usually be lime. So that's different. Sorry, I'm having trouble getting a grip on this. I didn't, I didn't want to tear it. Oh, okay, we're doing that. Okay, a Pakistani staple. So this one, I, we've been told by, about a lot of our... Oh, these are potato sticks too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it did say it that. It says it right It totally there. said that. Yeah. I, 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 I don't know. Anyway. It's okay. The Pakistani staple. We've been told about a lot of these things that we get that they're not all the best representations of what things have, but if this is not a good representation, this is, this is a total lie. Uh, I want this one. This one looks pretty good. So it looks exactly the same as the other potato sticks. If it tastes the same, we're just putting them both in the same sandwich bag. It doesn't taste the same. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I definitely get the flavors that it describes there. You need another one. Sorry, I keep elbowing the table. Hopefully that didn't uh, make too much noise for you. Um, the lemon... So it's... I think it starts with the chili. Then I get hit with the lemon, and then the chili comes back. It's weird. There's something I don't like about these. I don't know. It's an experience. At least they have MSG. That's good stuff. That is good stuff. Oh, gosh. I'd say, as far as the chips go, this one is the most powerful. It's got the most unique experience. I think it overtakes the other potato sticks for me. Th those don't have a whole lot going for them. They have a little going for them. But these, those are, like I said, those are an experience. It depends how much, it, but it is a lot. Like, if it was just spicy... It would be one thing, but it hits me with a slight spice. Then it hits me with like a weird tangy lemon, whatever. And then the spice just kind of sits on my tongue for a while. I like it. <laughs> like, it's not a bad spice. I don't like it. It's not too much. It's just kind of... it. I can see why it would make you like physically uncomfortable. If that's, if that's what your issue is. No, it tastes weird. I don't know. Hmm. All right, well... Yeah, there we go. It's just me. All right, what are we doing now? Oh my God, there's still so much. There's a lot. Why is there so much? So it looks like we have two of these. Oh, they doubled shit. up a lot of things. Well, it's the same brand. I. It's just it's, they gave us two packages of the same oh. thing, and, and there's still like so much more to do. Like I don't know. If, did I? Did was I? This one that we got late, and they were like, "Oh, well, we're sending these out late. Let's pack extra." I don't know. It's been months. <laughs> uh, so we got Brewery Bites It's got a weird spell into it uh, They're kind of gummy It seems We got like a blackberry type thing Type looking thing And then we got what the I assume is like The outside is crunchy and the inside is chewy Do you know which one you want? That red? One. You want the black one? I, I kind of want a red one there we go. 
Okay, so that's what the little guy looks like. It's got a little little bumpies on it. I can see how this could be a, a fun time. If you squint your eyes, it looks like a real blackberry. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that's kind of fun. I like that more than the watermelon. Hmm. It's a little weird. But like a fun weird. It's like little candy balls outside of the uh, the gummy candy. It, and they have a fun little flavor to it. And it, I think it comes together very well. This might be my favorite little sweet thing we've gotten so far. I don't know. I might return to that later when we're uh, trying to decide what our favorite thing is. I, I might have to give that one a second try. I'll try the black one next time. Any any updates here? Is that like moving That's up? That's my favorite. That's up for you That's too. So, Berry Bites is uh, a pretty big winner right now, I would say. Uh, you That's care. Good. Uh, we got so much stuff. There's a few chocolates. We usually get this, this much. Oh yeah, it's nice to do a little variety here. Uh, so we got Chocolato and from that Biscani brand, which I'm not super familiar with, but we've seen a little of today. I, I'm having trouble gripping packages right now. Um, I don't know. I open a lot of packs of Pokemon cards, so yeah, I know yeah. what I'm doing here. You're an expert. Go 50 50 on that. Ooh, oh, show I should have read the about it middle. Before I broke it. It's a little biscuit and it's got little, what one would assume is chocolate in the middle. Which, which this is the chocolato. So, this snack is the forbidden fruit of the cookie world. Sweet and crunchy biscuits surrounded with a rich and creamy center of chocolatey goodness. Whoa. I gotta go get the dog. You gotta get the dog. Okay. Let's go hold it. Oh, it's a cat! Oh, hold on, cat! Hold on, cat! I got you! It's a dog! It's a dog! Hello! <laughs> I'm back. Did mm. you, uh, did you enjoy the cookie? I didn't chew it while you were gone. No. <laughs> It's got a similar effect to uh, these little guys. They've kind of got a thinner biscuit material. I like this better. But yeah. I think this is really good. I think that's like the next step up. I've made such from a that. mess over here. Oh my gosh. It's okay. We'll clean it up if we have time. Yeah, <laughs> uh, no, we got time. We got time. Mm -hmm. We're going to finish. I, I was concerned because we have... I, I guess we're narrowing them down a little bit. I don't know where to go next. Are these jelly beans. More jiggles. So jiggles is wait. Yeah, you pointed this one out. There's three jiggles. So jiggles is the brand. Mm -hmm. Crunch is the uh, is the snack itself. Mm -hmm. So they're but but they're jelly beans. So they are, are jelly beans, which I assume have like a crunchy shell on the outside. I almost got it this time. I don't know why I can't get a grip on any of these things. These aren't meant to be opened like that. Oh, man. Well, that's a shame. That one doesn't even have a tear spot. It, it doesn't. Or, or is that supposed mm -mm. to be the tear spot? No. So, this is how. Okay. Stab it. Ooh. Oh, they're cute. You want a blue one? Is it blue okay? Okay, it's got a few colors. But right here, we got the forbidden blue. I want to try a second one if, uh, you want to try a second one? Oh, that's fun. I like that. I like adding textures to things that I already like. <laughs> hmm. What's up? You got a little blue, like in your lips. Did it color mine? No, I held mine for okay. a sec. Because it, it, it like came off like in the middle of her lips. 
I really like you. Okay. Well, do, are these like up there? Like, where are these mm. now? Those do are they the beat the berry yeah, bites? They do. they do. They might for me. I don't know. Right. I'm Come thinking on. about it. Come here, kitty. Um, I kind of want to do this one like towards the end. Okay. If that's okay. Uh, do you have another one you'd like to try? There's three chocolate things. Oh. Pick one. I, I'd want to do like this one at the end because it's a hard candy thing. Uh, so I guess let's just do wafers. Okay. Get the wafers out of the way. I don't know if anybody's ever done wafers significantly better than anyone else's wafers in the history of this series. I like sugar-free wafers, so like these are already. <laughs> Here you go. Do you want the whole thing or you want to break it in half? I'm not going to try to break this. It will be a mess. Okay. Then we shall both have one. Um, I'll break it in the package. So these are... Oh, I should. bad idea. Oh, okay, then I'll, I'll take the other half that you have in here. I, did okay. I show you guys the Novita? Uh, it's from the Biscotti people. Chocolate wafers. Creamy, crunchy, extra, whatever. I just flung some cookie at you. I apologize for the inconvenience. Um, indulge yourself in some irresistibly crisp vanilla wafers sandwiches. Sam Sorry. Sam wafers sandwiched by a rich chocolatey cream that's so good you won't be able to stop eating. Let's see about that. Like, I don't know what I expect. It's just, it's just a chocolate wafer. It's better than some of the chocolate wafers we've had, but, like, there's really not enough difference. Every time we get wafers, it feels like it's the cop-out candy or the cop-out snack. Like, I have nothing I can say that we haven't, like, with Morocco, we got, like, five packs of wafers, and they were all the same. <laughs> And I don't know how no, this is no. better or worse than any of those. There were the chocolate hazelnut ones. Okay, those that, really that was good. different. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. Would hate to oh. give oh. Uh, Morocco, oh. not give Morocco a fair shake. Um, but they did give us way too many wafers. I will say that. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. That one's cute. Oh, um, my God. We'll gosh. try the cute one. It's, oh, no. Oh, is that not? Oh, it's like a... It's cake. Panda cake? No, cake. It's it, spelled it, with a K. It, it's K-A-K-E, so I thought it was supposed to have like a weird <laughs> pronunciation. I cake. It feels like a cake. An irresistible burst of flavor. This deliciously golden brown panda-shaped cake is filled with a smooth... An ooey gooey strawberry cream center. This I'm excited about. Please be cute. I want this. Be it cute. Be it, cute. it looks like it's just a. Uh, it looks like it's got some shape to it. I was about to say it no, just no, looks no, like no, a. No 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 wait give it give it a sec. Aww. Oh, hold on. Uh did did a piece fall off? Get back. You killed it. Shut up. <laughs> Well, that's, you can that's see it was bear. you can see it was supposed to be uh, a like pun. a bear. Does I I actually like really it? like oh, the look of this. Oh, his nose ended up in his hand. Oh no, and poor his thing. His eyes ended up on his ears. Oh, that's so sad. Let's take his head off. <laughs> I hope he feels better. Oh no. Oh, that looks like a wonderful experience. This is. This feels like one of those really dumb, indulgent snacks you'd get at a gas station. Like, you know it's a bad idea, but you do it anyway. It smells like fake strawberry. Just like the gas station snacks. This is my favorite. Easy. That, uh, the strawberry stuff, it tastes fake, but it tastes good. <laughs> This isn't your type of snack. Like, I actually like Lil Debbie snacks you get from a gas station. I never liked those. You never liked those at all. Mm -mm. I actually like them. This is my favorite. <laughs> Even as a kid, I it, didn't want them. It, it, I wanted it's nachos. Like, my, my parents always uh, 
divided things and they, they called things junk food, but when it came to those, they were garbage food. They, they, like they, they were so, they deemed them so bad and indulgent that they called them garbage food. That's, that's a, a step above. I'm down with it. All right, so uh, Prince Chocolate. Yes. Prince Chocolate, it is. I I really wanted to try that thing, that other thing last. That looks different. Okay. This looks uh, pretty standard. Prince Chocolate. It has a you know cookie. What looks like kind of a European style looking prince, which is interesting. Maybe that has something to do with the French influence. <laughs> that is apparently there, you know, that I I wasn't aware of. Um, ooh, this is uh, a little bit damaged. Would you like to take some of this, or do you want to try taking your own? Do you want to try? I mean, the table's a mess anyway. Which one do you want? Little. You want the little one? I want the little one. Okay. Here, here it is. Here's the little cross section of the cookie. It's kind of got this little hard looking chocolate thing. It's like, it looks like it's supposed to be an Oreo, but it looks very firm, like firmer than an Oreo's center. Got problems? It fell apart. Oh no. Got a problem, bro? Mmm. <laughs> Mm-hmm. You didn't like it? Not enough to finish it. Mm. Mm. I don't know if my taste just hasn't fully come back or something. Oh, yeah. Uh, we both had COVID. I never lost my taste. Just, uh, she did. But, uh, completely but, gone. But it's been a little bit. You should have it back. I know, but <laughs> none of this has had a strong flavor. A lot of it hasn't. Okay. To be fair. Okay. There's something about that chocolate in the middle of it. It, it's texture. It, it feels like crap. It feels cheap. It feels awful. But is is it weird? I feel like oddly nostalgic. Is there something we grew up with that perhaps I'm thinking of here? Because there's something kind of nostalgic about that. Yeah, your snack cakes. Any of them that had chocolate on it's the same thing. Uh, Plastic they, chocolate. It. I, I maybe I'm fond of plastic chocolate more than most I don't know I thought that was a good time we're sneaking more jelly beans you can have those you can you can have those if you'd like you can take them to work with you snag jelly beans out of your pocket uh, so here we have uh, I think I've, I know about wispy I think I've heard of this uh, wispy Halal is the, it looks no. like it's the brand, the little thing, no, H-I-L-L. Um, is that on everything? Is that not the brand? No. I'm confused is about that, how branding works. Maybe. I don't. I think Halal is the brand and Wispy is the snack. If it's on multiple things, it's a brand. No, but Halal means like, it doesn't use any pork product or anything like that. Mmm, okay. That would make sense. I can't imagine much uses uh, pork Gel project. Gelatin. But it says in the ingredients, oh, okay. beef gelatin. Oh, cool. So, halal means it's okay to eat it. Oh, right, smarty pants. <laughs> I didn't mean that for that to sound uh, disparaging. Like, genuinely, I'm glad you knew that. This looks like a dog treat. <laughs> This looks like, have any like that? this this looks like like a, a kind of dog treat. I hate myself. I, I knew it was gonna I, happen. Yeah, too. it was it was not the right texture I've for that. Things like it, this before. It, it's, it's okay. We we got enough to <laughs> sample it. I can I can eat up that later. It's fine. It's all fine. Mm hmm. Hmm. How much more can I stick my thumb up? Ah, okay. Um, that was, uh, that's good. Um, when it comes to wafers, you often get just vanilla or chocolate. This is like kind of a wafery 
thing and strawberry is kind of a refreshing thing. When I go for wafers, I go for strawberry. Often. When the option's there. <laughs> and you're going back for more, so it's got to be okay. Mm -hmm. Um, Pretty good. Yeah. I like that one. Um, You've never had the wafer straws before? I can't remember. I used to get them when I was a kid. Hmm. They were chocolate. Really enjoyed this. And coffee ones. Those are really good. I might go back to these later. Um, I, now I, I don't know what my favorite thing is now. I'm a little thrown off. Either way, we got one left. So we may as well uh, get started with it. Mango flavored. Are they mango? It mm -hmm. looks like they look like lemons. There you go. No, they're mango. There we go. It's uh, candies, amorous. Mm -hmm. Candies. Can <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I think the camera's probably gonna overheat, so we're gonna give us a minute to suck on these. Maybe put clean up a little bit, and uh, we'll be back to you with the verdict these on these little things. They're they're little yellow things, and they <laughs> clearly have okay. something in the middle. Uh, so we'll be right back. So I'd hate to go out with kind of a whimper, but this, <laughs> don't break a tooth. Um, but these, they're, they're, they're merely okay. It's got, yeah, it's got the mango thing and neither you or I are the biggest mango people. Mm -hmm. As far as like a sucky candy, it's, it does its job pretty well. There's nothing particularly exceptional or offensive about it, it's uh, generally all right. So uh, I guess what we gotta do now is decide our favorites, which you did pretty easily. So you liked the Jiggles Crunch, Crunch Jelly Beans. They're very crunchy for a jelly bean. I like them. I, I think that's the gimmick. Um, like, I had I had some uh, like a soft spot for this little panda cake thing. Um, is it the best? I, I feel weird saying it's the best. It feels it feels wrong to like. It's like, but that's kind of the point of like little snack cakes. <laughs> they're they're supposed to be indulgent. They're supposed to make you feel guilty on the inside. So maybe that's perfect. Don't let society tell you to feel bad. I appreciate the encouragement. So Enjoy I, your garbage. I will food. claim this garbage, this terrible thing that I shouldn't enjoy as mine. It was my favorite. And you can have the jelly beans. Uh, as far as like things that were close, like this is my favorite wafer thing we've had in a little bit. The wisp thing. Sorry. Wispy? Wispy? Mm -hmm. what, did I call it wisp earlier? I probably did. Um, the wispy thing, that was pretty good. As far as wafers go, that's probably one of my favorite. I, like, I had a soft spot for this Prince Chocolate thing. Um, overall, I think this is a pretty good one. It didn't have, like, really low lows or, like, really high highs, but I think a lot of it was pretty okay. I had too much sugar. <laughs> sugar. Oh, feel good. <laughs> okay, well, may maybe we should uh, take it easy for the rest of the day. All right. So, you found your favorite. Is there any mm -hmm. other things that you thought were kind of like highlights? The Wispy's really good. The Wispy's good? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, yeah, we, we've, uh, I would say Pakistan ranks decently high. We've had some disappointments when it comes to the snack crates, but I'd say Pakistan, it was, uh, it was consistent kind of across the board. Like, it had some things that were just dull. It had some things that were merely okay, but nothing too bad. Uh, so I would say it was a good experience. I, I could see myself returning to just about anything on here. There's nothing that I would just throw out. <laughs> Sorry, I was channeling a demon. There's, there's <laughs> nothing that I would just throw out. All right. <laughs> okay. So we had fun? Mm-hmm. Okay. And we'll be back in the near future. You and I are probably going to record it sooner rather than later. 
Yeah. Uh, but uh, it'll probably be at least a week or two in between the actual uploads. But we have a couple crates sitting up there, ready to go. One just came in today, so we we've got a uh, we've got plenty of snacks to go through, and I'm excited for it. No stopping at the convenience store for snacks. I gotta I gotta get the snacks that I already have in my boxes. <laughs> One of our crates we got is like like. A third taller than the others, which I'm very curious about that. He's a thick boy. He's a thick boy. So next time we're going to do a thick boy. All right. You can't do that yeah, on YouTube. Uh, you can't do that on YouTube. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> it's, it's good having you. We'll, we'll see you all in the next I'm one. I'm sorry too. I'm, I'm sorry for everything you've done. All right. Thank you. Like, comment, and subscribe. Um, <laughs> we'll see you next time. All right. Bye.